I'm Greg Engert, beer director for the Neighborhood Restaurant Group, and this is your craft beer and brewing tip of the week. To serve these beers too cold would mean that you would never get to experience all of these compounds. Like I said before, you serve a beer too cold, you numb your palate, now you can't taste anything. But also if you serve it too cold, you can't smell anything. It's similar to cooking at your house, right? You might have some leftover pizza in the fridge. You might like eating cold pizza, but when you taste cold pizza, you don't taste anything. Now, when you take that cold pizza and you put it into your oven, after a few minutes, your entire kitchen smells like pizza. And that's because heat and evaporation releases the organic and chemical, aromatic, volatile compounds within that dish, that food, but also within the beer. So in order to smell beers, to smell the compounds of the beers, you need a certain degree of heat. And that's why even for the lightest, most refreshing styles of beer, to serve them at 37 degrees means that you just can't smell anything. At 42 degrees and a really crisp, refreshing Pilsner, you can parse the flavors of the hop in the nose. You can smell the different malt characteristics. But at 42 degrees, you still maintain taste and texture because at that temperature, you're still gonna maintain the carbonation. It's still gonna be refreshing and crisp on the palate. To learn more about world-class beer service, click the link below.